the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's Borussia Dortmund. They take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It is Borussia Dortmund, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This spectacular save, top-class goalkeeping. Vinicius Junior. This is the lineup for Dortmund. Marcel Zabitzer plays alongside Emre Can in the centre of midfield. And Niklas Fulkrug is up front. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Nacho Fernandez in central defence. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And it's two strikers in front who look to provide the goal-scoring threat. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Oh, he can score here, Derek. And danger still. Tony Kors and Bellingham now with Mendy and a chance for the lead and they score first goal in this season's UEFA Champions League final well just look at his movement he knows exactly how to find space and it's also a tidy finish that's a nice goal. Well, Borussia Dortmund restart the match. Will that goal have the effect of stinging them into action? Brandt. Defensive pressure high up the pitch. Might work out. Oh, equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing to people can do about that. defensive acumen to cut it out Fulkrug Zabica and he takes on the shot oh he couldn't out with the keeper trying to deliver it accurately oh that's not a good clearance now breaking at pace, potential danger. Mendy, given away by Real Madrid. Needs to take great care. Again, and you have to say, this is a very good volley. His technique is absolutely perfect. Uh, 
So back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Daniel Malin. Emre Can. Perfect tackle. continues and no shortage of goals 3-1 as things stand Malin the inside route looking promising that's a foul and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick Please no doubt. Carvajal. Rudiger has it. Nacho Fernandez. Force making quite a bit of progress. But nothing comes of it. We're really closing him down here. Dortmund being afforded too much room. Throw-ins given. Yeah. It's time to play it over. Superbly read and executed. So on the cusp of half-time and Real Madrid well on top. Stuart, interested as always to get your take. Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Mendy. Now with Bellingham. Big opportunity. Going for the team. Oh, that is a moment of pure quality. A goal for football lovers to enjoy the world over. Well, here's the replay and he shows great awareness to play this through ball and then the finish is really good he just dinks it over the keeper that's an excellent goal well he looks really pleased doesn't he his side have been really good today well on they go again and Real very much in control A nicely cut out. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Tony Kroos. Mendy has it. Vinicius Junior. And Bellingham. Is it going to be? And the referee's whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium. The ball moving again, and Real very much in charge of this one. That'll 
be a Dortmund ball. Hummers. Decent looking pass. Inside he goes. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. to nothing in the end and it's gone out of play for the Dortmund throw in on a really good run Sancho Just look at his movement, he knows exactly how to find space, and it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Carvajal. And now Rodrigo. Well, they have it again. Emre Can. Ian Madsen. And he read that brilliantly at the back. Rodrigo. Federico Valverde. Really good challenge. And Borussia Dortmund in a position of menace. And it's gone behind for the corner. Trying to pick out a teammate. Was it a great clearance? Zabita. Back for Sancho. get at the opposition and saved by the keeper Rodrigo Carvajal and it will be a free kick to Real Madrid Force. that was Valverde Mendy has it. Mendy cuts it back. Might be onto something with that ball. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Chance here. Well, you're bound to be a bit cross with yourself when you're presented with that sort of opportunity. Well, in the end, it's a fairly easy save for the goalkeeper, but really, that should have been a goal. Good through ball. Great opportunity, and then, oh yes, exactly what they were hoping to produce, they've delivered the goal. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. to the last 20 minutes. Dortmund unable to retain possession. And Bellingham has eyes for goal! That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Producing a save to match. 
it. Substitution for Real Madrid. Luka Modric with the corner. Real defensive resilience. Blocked again. And return to Valverde. Valverde takes on the shot. Oh, that's a fine save. a high percentage option to try your luck from there. Well, his teammates aren't particularly happy. He was never going to score from there. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Just ten minutes to go. Audacious effort. Not every player would try that type of thing. And Dortmund will go to the bench. Marcel Zabitza. Well, Real Madrid fans have enjoyed this. A dominant performance, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Over it comes. And efficient defending. Valverde. And Bellingham. Good ball over the top. Vasquez. And Bellingham. And he could give it away. Mendy and Bellingham mopping up defensively and the referee is going to add on four added minutes Vasquez and Valverde and no way to sugarcoat that one Stuart well sometimes it's worth having a shot from distance but he never really set himself to hit that cleanly. Well, as you can see, it wasn't even close, was it? No debate about that one. Kahi Adeyemi leading it through. My goodness, it looked as though he was clean through. And the referee, what will he do here? And a red card it is. Denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity. Well, as soon as he made the tackle, he knew the outcome. That's an easy decision for the referee. Well, he doesn't like that decision, does he? He's absolutely livid. Superstop. 
wonderful goalkeeping. And there it is, Real Madrid, Champions League winners. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. And that's exactly what they're doing trotting over towards their supporters to say thank you, a collective effort always on these occasions. Well, what more can you say? They are the best team in Europe. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. 